This is the Youth Revolution. I'm Brooke, and you're watching a lesson for the Curtis Mayfield song, Move On Up. I'm going to show you what it looks like and sounds like. Hush now, child. There's four chords, we play them in the same order the whole time. B minor, A, B minor, F sharp minor. Let's break down the counts for each chord. For E minor, we have six counts. One, two, three, four, five, six. A for two, seven, eight. B minor for six. One, two, three, four, five, six. F sharp minor, seven, eight. E minor. So you can actually just play it like that with down strums, no problem. If you don't want to just use a down strum, we're using basic strum one, down, down, up, up, down, up, followed by four down strums. So we have E minor, down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down. A for two down strums. And then the same thing with B minor and F sharp minor. B minor gets down, down, up, up, down, up, down, down. And F sharp minor gets down down. You may notice after playing that down 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 part of the strum, you may have an incidental up after each down down. Let me show you what I mean. Down down up up down up down down up down down up down down up up down up down down up down down up down. Totally fine. What makes it sound a little bit funky is that it begins on the F sharp minor. When you hear that trumpet sound at the beginning, that's the 7-8. It doesn't start on the 1. Just wanted to make a note of that because I found it a little bit tricky. This song is actually in the key of B minor, so if you want to end the song, we'll end it on B minor. So this is like all kinds of things that make this tricky, but I think it's what gives it that atmosphere of like lift. Move on up. <laughs> so a note about singing. Um, when you begin singing, you begin on the F sharp minor, just like the horns come in on F sharp minor. For example, the move on up part is on F sharp minor. Move on up. And the verses, the verses begin with F sharp minor. Hush now, child. Don't cry. This happens often in a lot of songs. It's just for this song, it makes it particularly tricky with the rhythm of the strum and the rhythm of the chord changes. So I wanted to point it out. Let's play along one verse and one chorus with the chords on the screen so you can kind of get an idea of what the hell I've been talking about. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Hush now, child. Don't you cry. Your folks might understand you by and by. Just move on up. Move 
If you like this lesson, click like. If you like to support the Uke Revolution on Patreon, you can find me there. It's the Uke Revolution. You'll have early access to this YouTube content with no ads and exclusive content twice a month. Come and see me over there. I'm Brooke. I'll see you next time. Peace out.